Hey, well, how's it going, Blue Riser? Here. It's been a while since I've touched Bleach, and uh, really, <laughs> I haven't touched it in the past few days. Oh wow, lost memory summons. So I had the comeback thing, right? And they give you a battle ready six star. So it's level 150. Everything's good for it. Let's just go ahead and use that. See what we get. We're gonna use some of these tickets, and then we're gonna get straight into the main summoning, the main meat, the really main meat. You know what I mean? The new swimsuit versions of Tier Holly Bell and uh, Soy Phone and Orihime. I don't care about Orihime too much. This is a new Byakuya for me. Think that's the full ring arc? I believe so. Now, honestly, every time I come to this game, I only summon for one of two things. It has to be a Yodoichi, whatever it is. If it's Yodoichi, I'm there. I have to summon for or it has to be some sort of fan service. I know, right? I'm disgusting. But still, it's really the only things I'm here for. I don't care too much about the meta since I don't play the game like that. I'm, I'm very casual. And summoning is like really what I'm in for. Like, I just want Bleach characters, to be honest. Ooh, a five star. Yeah, five star, right? Who is this? Ukiota. Do I have an Ukiota? Maybe. And then Gimryu side. I can't wait for the new Gimryu. Oh, wait. I think the... There's going to be one more Thousand Year Blood War. Okay, there's new Ukiyo. There's going to be one more Thousand Year Blood War character pack. I heard. Someone someone can easily tell me if I'm wrong on that. I hope not. Does that mean we're not getting Quincy's? I really want Quincy's. And then we have five Brave Soul tickets. We're not going to use, like, the 48 tickets there. I had, like, a hundred or so of those silver tickets. And I've been just using them as time has gone by. Okay, nothing good. Just skip that. But yeah, I mean, all I really am is excited for the characters in this game. Not really their use. Because for the most part, the characters I have, I have a lot of good ones too. Apparently I do. I don't really worry about events or even difficulty of it. I'll do a little bit of grinding. But for the most part, this game, I don't play it a lot. I just play it enough that way I have stuff to summon. Now, who do I want the most? Soyphone. Soyphone is amazing. People people want to hate on Soyphone. Because she doesn't have the TNA like Haribel or um or Hime, but come on, Soyphone is amazing. You gotta, you gotta give her a chance. Alright, let's go. Excited, I wanna see what's gonna happen. If I get Haribel, I might just stop. If I get Soyphone, I might just stop. I don't wanna push my luck. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think that's Orihime. No, it's Nelio. Right, right, right. The other swimsuits are in here. Eh, whatever. Why you go? Eh, eh. I really get two five stars in one pack. I got um thousand year blood war. Okay, I got thousand year blood war. Hitsugaya and Komamura, I think, in the same pull, in the same like multi. I'm really not too happy getting that Nelio. Now that I'm thinking about it, like in my head, I'm like, oh, I really didn't want her. <laughs> I could care less. Nelio is not one of my favorite characters at all. But I mean, hey, she's my 320th character, so cool enough, right? Yeah, she's. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan. Please, five star. Nope, four star. Yes, Chad. Damn, really? Just Chad, skip it. Anyone, anyone new? Anyone good? Nope, doesn't look like it. All right, next one. Man, we're already running out. That's crazy to me. Like, if it's Nelio, Soy Phone, not Nelio. Whoa, another four star. Skip. Kugo, Lisa. Nothing, not even a swimsuit character. Damn, I'm gonna literally be at zero. That really happens to me in this game. Normally, I have like around a thousand at all times. Okay, okay. Who? Veruca? I don't know, I just. I'm not excited for that. Yeah, I'm just not excited for that. I got plenty of time. 
New five star means more orbs, but like, damn. Two five star swimsuit units. I just couldn't care uh, less about. And we got one more multi left. I'm not sure. Oh, we're full. Great. I'll be right back. Okay, so we've got a few more orbs for maxing out some characters. Uh, the newer five stars we just got. So we're gonna try again. We're gonna try one multi, and then we have enough for a few singles, and see what we get. And you know, what? I should have done the singles first, really. Whatever. Yeah, it's fine. Five star. Five star. Five. Oh my god. Skip. That sucks. Oh, that sucks so much. Look at that. That's horrible. Okay, so we have enough for a few singles. We're going to go ahead and try... I think we have enough for, what? Six of them? So we're going to try six. See what we can get. I've never really done singles in this game. I mainly kind of rely on multis. Only because this kind of reason. It's... I, I don't know. A multi guarantees four star or higher. But seeing how I probably won't be able to get the orbs anymore. I might as well just try to risk it all now. Like, I doubt I'll be able to get, like, a substantial amount of, um orbs to make any sort of difference why can't we have more like three star swimsuit characters most of them are men like uh Rinji, Ichigo, and Byakuya I would, I would appreciate some three star females too I understand why they make them five stars but like still I would take some three star females at least a, a bit more yeah oh, four star yeah okay Get out of here, hit the guy. Okay, three more left. Not really hoping for much, <laughs> to be honest. My expectations are very low. Very, very low. You know, I wish more games did, like, if you have two, two pulls, right? Like, I have 50 right now. That's two pulls. Like, I wish they would just be like, you can pull both right now. That'd be so nice. And make things so much easier. But whatever. Now, I believe 3rd Anniversary is coming up too, and there's a character that is being drafted or designed by Kubo himself. I'm pretty interested, which is the only reason I'm kind of getting back into this game. Like, I want to see what they're going to do, what Kubo is going to do, and plus I want to see more Thousand Year Blood War stuff. Last time I played this game was the last Thousand Year Blood War, was it? Or was it Valentine's Day? It was one of the two, I believe it was Unahana though. I could be wrong. Yeah, alright. Never my favorite girl can save me. Why didn't I get a swimsuit girl, Luigi? Is she in this banner? Let me check real quick. No, she's not. That's a travesty. It's an absolute travesty. So I got two of the other ones. I don't care about um, Nimu either. That Unahana, no. I mean, if it was a girl, Luigi, I would probably be excited no matter what. But still, like, swimsuit one would be better for the occasion. And then Isane, eh, whatever. I love how it says right here, the EXP and coin and Cones Bonanza will be doubled while the pool battle summons is available. So you'll be able to easily power up any new characters you are lucky enough to pull. Lucky. God, I really wanted Soy Phone so bad. She's so nice. Her hairstyle is like also really freaking cute. Holly Bell is going crazy with her outfit. But when is her outfit not crazy? But look at that. Look at her hair. It's amazing. Or he may sure whatever she got like um halloween of 2017 she had a new one that one was pretty crazy fan service and to be honest i can't really complain that much i have quite a bit of good characters i got both the um yachiru from the thousand year blood war and the kapachi from the thousand year blood war the only one i was missing was unohana who was the one i was going for the most but then i also had gotten the um the ichigo with the hollow mask and he's in bankai form and then also, uh, to note, we have the live-action movie coming out pretty soon, which, cool enough, um, if I can find a way to see it, I'll probably see it. It doesn't look bad, but I'm not going to say it looks good either. Now, as far as adaptations go, I think people need to be a bit more lenient when it comes to live-action adaptations. I'm not saying defend a bad movie, but I am saying that you have to change your mindset when you're watching a live ad adaptation of a manga or anime. You know, they can't stay the same. It's just an adaptation. It's just another way to tell the story. Regardless if it's good or not, I don't know yet. I might want to see it, though. Other than that, uh, 
I've been rambling about this game. I play it quite a bit. Now I do. Because I do take like good extensive breaks on this game. I will be back probably for the third anniversary or thousand year blood war more part stuff. So whatever those are and they'll just be summoning videos. That's all I really care about with this game. Like I'm not here doing like PvP. Is there PvP? It's the arena. I'm not here doing that or really multiplayer grind sessions. That's not really me. I've just had this game since like day one around that time and so I'm very just hesitant of getting rid of it so it's just always around for me I can't can't do anything with now nice butt Ruka I can see why they made a new Orihime or no jiggle physics guess not and well I'm done here too bad I didn't get so full on the Hari Bell maybe next time maybe I'll just do some pulls off screen see what I get meet when I have like the souls necessary but don't forget to check out the channel. I have literally hundreds of videos for you to enjoy. I have more Bleach Brave Soul videos. Well, some of these I should say. If you want to check those out, just search Bleach on the channel and you should be able to find them. If not, I'll make a playlist. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.